Alrighty, hello boys and girls, how's everybody doing? Back in Generation Zero. Knocking stuff out. And, uh, doing this mission called Road Rage, I believe. Yeah, we gotta locate the missing military truck. Oh, I think I see something. Saw Robit over here. Do we have here? Nothing, it, ap it appears. <laughs> Take that and this. a beacon it's not on the compass oh shit we got a hunter too Okay. 
Nice. deal. There was, I don't think I'm going to find it. Oh. a silencer though yeah because like i said last time i need i think it was last time i need to pick up even the crappy weapons so that i can break them down for parts okay and then I'm, i am going to go ahead and use at least one of these simples Oh, and that's right. I th in my off time, I did get a second augmentation. Whoops. I uh, got the oversized magazine, which for us is just one shell at the moment. I do need to uh, get some more weapon parts so I can upgrade that magazine size. Maybe we should do the house first, but I think I'm going to do the truck first. See, what would be useful? There is a hunter. I saw those ticks. Okay, I think. Where? That didn't go too bad. Any 
anybody else up front here? No, it doesn't look like it. Another weapon. Ah, there's the weapon. Nice. Kind of alternate between when it's like 762 and explosive. Uh, alternate, like if I pick one, then I don't another. Or like this adhesive, I can use. Simple first aid kit is nice, but I think I'm probably sitting all right with that. Um, so yeah, like with well, like I said, the ones with the 762 and something, I may or may not. I usually take like every other one. It just depends. Because uh, we do need to be mindful of our of weight somewhat but then we also need to be mindful of getting resources to craft certain things uh like i said i i can't increase the magazine size improve the augmentation on the shotgun without more weapon parts oops oh wait i passed on whatever that one thing's got okay let's see uh is this the... Nope, this is over and out. What was that one? Path of the Gods. Um, okay, let's go ahead and highlight it real quick. And where is it on the map? over and out. Yeah, right there. You're approaching the next radio tower that is causing the signal to be jammed. Uh, it seems to be hidden pretty deep in the forest near Grontorp. Let's assume our window to make contact will be very short. Clearly, the enemy can activate other jammers. Let's see if we 
can't hack this guy. Oh, he's got a 50-50 chance. Oh, I think we got him. Still hacked. Hey, sorry, buddy. like that. We'll just take that. Not that we need any of it. But it was pretty good numbers and useful enough stuff. Same thing with that. Although I should be maybe be more pick up more 762 because uh, for my buddy BJ he probably could still use some. He was telling me he came across a robot called a Reaper and I guess it's supposed to be the hardest Hardest uh, robots you can find. Uh, one of the soldiers in the dispatch team started writing this, but didn't get to finish. Moving the machine only cleared the disturbance for a few seconds, then return. It may be covered by other masks. We'd require intervention teams to to deploy it on all to be deployed. I'm guessing is what he meant. All the other masks and clear them, but with our comm script, up, it's near impossible. Use the dispatch squad's radio. Oh. Is it in the car? Yep, yeah, yeah, that's what it is, okay. Это советский крейсер Кружный, крейсер лейтенант Кузнецов. Всем гражданам Швеции в регионе Эстертерн. Копл Понтус Ковач. We're a small group of survivors located in the archipelago. Over. Copy that. Listen to me carefully. Your situation is even more critical than you realize. We believe these machines have taken over all of Osterton. I repeat, all of Osterton. Over. Copy that. What can you tell us about the enemy? Over. We do not know. We are in the process of investigating and confirming the origin of the enemy. But for the time being, we... Alright. Oh, 
we lost the signal again. So, they're all over us a ton. God, so wherever we go, we won't be safer than here. Look, I don't know if we can trust what they are saying. Maybe my parents were right about the Soviets all along. We should get rid of all the jammers, and then we'll see. Oh, here we go. And that's another thing. I all right, so this is where we are. Asatan has no police left, probably no army either. Most of the radio spectrum is jammed, and people were either killed or kidnapped. What do we do now? I, I, I don't know. I think we gotta explore the other regions in Estaton. Each region has a command bunker, so I imagine we can follow new leads using the other warboards. Yes, and maybe find some other survivors too. We're not alone. We can't be. We just need to find them. We should also contact those Soviets again. I just want to find out who our enemies are and where they are. I got this. No. Nope. Oh yeah, I did. Uh, yeah, cause I'm I. I need to craft more somethings so that I can unlock the schematics for those sticky flares. And then I also need to learn <laughs> how to throw them correctly. Um, and you know what? Let's just go here. I don't rem remember if there's a crafting bench at this safe house or not. I know there's... a group of dogs around it. What are you doing? <laughs> Poking your face through there. Oh, what's this? Oh, this looks like a silencer. I'll take it. Just scrap it. Check you. Yes. Plus those I can make easy enough. Oh, you know what? I will take a 7.62.
Damn. Don't kill me. up. Looking forward, to, you know, into the future for when I can craft those sticky flares. Is he the only one? Where'd he go? Oh, am I? In oh, I'm encumbered. doing Get over here, dog. We'll deal with this beacon. Well, I think we got some more bad guys that direction. All right, let's. Whoops. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay. Oh, it's doing this again.
thought there was a hunter. Maybe he got destroyed when the beacon got destroyed. I thought I saw bad guys over here. I've either moved on or I was mistaken. Oh, so, alright, so here we can craft. Well, you know what? Let's take a quick look here. Um, blah, 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 blah. Wait, no, I want to look at schematics. And we want. Whoops, equipment. I believe. Yeah, hold on. What tree is it on? Oh, here we go. So yeah, so we need to get the boombox thing. Now oh, it's going to be... Whew, what is that? I'm going to guess 120? Because we can't... So we need 40 to get this. And then another 80 to get the emergency flare. Sticky. There's our stash box. Let's just go ahead. Oh, you know what? Uh, okay, real quick. Sorry. Is there any other? Oh, yeah, there is a recycling. Okay. 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 So let's do this. I'm gonna grab these five, five, six because we don't use them. I'm gonna 
get rid of them. Same thing with these. I'm just going to drop them. I don't think that's enough to recycle. Okay. So now we need the weapons on us. Whoops. Actually, you know what? Let's just go to recycling. Okay. So then we can store all resources. Then we can recycle this, 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 and this, and this, and this, and this. that. Yeah, so we need a minimum batch of 20 for those. Uh, uh, uh. Yeah, we'll get rid of these. Stuff off our doggo. Where'd he go? Oh, I picked him up by accident. Oh my god. I, uh, let's see here. Let him take this. This. This, this, and that's good. Okay, I was thinking, I thought I saw something else to recycle but it, that wasn't the thing um, it's stuff to put into our storage all right so we want to store not any ammo but we don't need this many let's go with half and I might hang on to the flares for now we don't need this many but go with half. no you know what we'll, we'll put 20 back Simple first aid. You know, I think we can go with 20. Probably don't need 10 adrenaline shots. Let's go with 8. 8 to go back. And we'll keep 2 on us. And we'll put one of these away. So that way, the next time we do play with BJ, we'll have a field radio. And. Uh, we don't probably don't need four repair kits. I'm gonna put three back because I think there's two or three on our companion. Okay, cool, awesome.
Can I even get up there? I don't even know if there's anything on that body, but... I don't think we can get up there. So it is unusual that they would... Oh yeah, there is something. Ah. <laughs> oh my god. You know what? I'm just going to take that for the effort. You know, one thing I've never understood about this game is that, see, look, you can switch these lights on and off. I don't know for what, for, why you'd want it. I don't think it affects anything. stuck on.
It's funny, I can't believe it just took me this long to to realize, because I think it's about the longest amount of time I've gone without thinking about the new Fallout show since the latest trailer. Oh my god, it looks so good. I mean, it's no guarantee, but I got really good feelings and high hopes for that show. And, um, yeah, oh man, I, I, I'm hyped. Trying to keep it in check. I guess it's one good thing about getting older. I feel like I am a little bit better at... Feeling the height, but also not letting it get away from me. Oh, man. And I'm, you've probably heard me say it before, but I really wish Microsoft would... Force Bethesda and Obsidian and is it in exile? That is former original Fallout developers. Anyways, and say, all right, you guys, suck it up. Form a team consisting of all of y'all and make a new Fallout game. It doesn't have to be Bethesda. You get, you get official. Main, main line, main story, Fallout 5. But then you create this special Fallout studio to make... And when I say something like Fallout New Vegas, I don't mean necessarily Fallout New Vegas Part 2, but something in the sense that it's not a mainline game. Uh, you know, it could be related to the TV show. Um, you know, maybe you, I don't know, I was trying to say that it doesn't even have to be necessarily open world RPG, it could be something, well, I think they've done a real time strategy, but you know, that was not good, I hear. But you could try that, but you could also do something like, um, what is, what, it was on the tip of my tongue, what was I just thinking of? Oh, I know, something like, um, can be played single player, multiplayer, kind of like The Division, I guess, where you can play co-op, single player. have recurring missions again I'm just that's just off the top of my head because even as I'm saying that eh, it doesn't really sound like the greatest idea but you get my point uh, I, however I would love like a new traditional RPG open world Fallout game And I guess what I was thinking, kind of like, oh, excuse me, like uh, New Vegas, is that it wouldn't, and I, f I feel like this is kind of important for, like, the non-main story games. They, they don't have to, maybe they shouldn't be vault dwellers. Wait a second. I don't know. Go ahead and pick these up. But yeah, maybe you're a ghoul, maybe a traitor. Oh, snap. I didn't mean to do that. These look like simple ones. I'm going to pass. Speaking of which, we have picked up a couple. I think I am going to go ahead and... Use one. Two, even.
I was thinking about repairing our companion, but I think I'm going to let that ride a little bit more. Alright, let's see here. Ah, I see what I'm supposed to do. Ouch. <laughs> oh, the, I was going to say, there's no one there. Okay. I guess it's freaking out. In case no one's told you yet, I'm... Uh, wait, where's Freddy? Where's everyone? Oh, I remember seeing my head. Oh, yeah, there is supposed to be someone here. <laughs> it's bugging out. need to find out if my nephew or anyone else made it out of here alive. I know we just met, but in this world it's humans against aliens. So I'll trust you and uh, you trust me, okay? I think we found all the weapons, but that is okay. Well, I think that is a good place to wind things up. Um, not a bad little episode, I would say. Um, th thank you, Doggo, for agreeing with me. Uh, anyways, thanks for stopping by. I hope you like what you saw, and I hope I see you next time. Until then, Palpatine out.